Poppy was so small, she had to stay inside with us. And she's just really extremely happy in the house. She was like, wow, that coach is amazing. And she was chasing balloons in our living room the entire day until she fell asleep. One time she was like, oh, there is a bed, I can jump on that. And then she started jumping on it and it was so funny. And she was really like, okay, everybody's my friend now. Poppy was born on a dairy farm in Belgium. The farmer didn't see any future for Poppy because they already had so many female sheep. I'm founder of Daisy Fields Animal Sanctuary. We are currently caring for 70 animals. He asked if she could come to our sanctuary and we said, of course, yes. <laughs> So we started to bottle feed her immediately. She was so small, we had to put a little sweater on. She had to stay inside with us in our living room. And she was really such a sweetheart and so easy. So look at that That was the beginning of a really nice and lovely bond between me and Poppy. She always asks for cuddles and she loves sleeping in my lap. Bobby! And she really knows her name. When I call her, she's there. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bit different than the other sheep, even though they see me as their mother too. During the day, we went outside together so she can start explore the meadow and the other sheep. But the nice thing with sheep is they almost welcome every other sheep. In the beginning, she tried to come to our living room like all the time. Several times I saw Poppy on the couch like, Hi, I'm back! But the transition went pretty smoothly. <laughs> Poppy has like that zest for life that she shows every day, every minute. Poppy! Okay, I'm so happy to be alive and that's really something. She's such a beautiful sheep.